Hello everyone, today I'm going to talk about Ona Hemimelia imaging. Ona Hemimelia is a rare clinic, congenital heart polyp anomaly characterized by complete or partial absence of the ulnar bone. Incident is estimated at 1 over 100,000 to 150,000 labor with a male to female ratio 3 2. Only hemimelia may be associated with other skeletal anomaly like synactyly, or it may be part of a syndrome like Hollen. Syndrome, Kupel Fair Syndrome, Ghost Colin Syndrome, as a tag. Oligodactyly and shortening of forearm is noted with ulnar gel of the wrist joint. The portion of the hand tend to drip to the ulnar size of the wrist. Cubital wrapping is also seen in most cases, which may cause thick flexion deformity. Patients with ulnar hemimelia have motion and functional limitation as well. General imaging methods of consideration include Midland deformity, short online, decontrol kinesis, intertograph, special absent online, severely, severely shortened online, oligodactyly in rolling, the ulnar size of kappa, meta kappa, and pollen. Peak flexion deformity of the elbow joint, radio ulnar sinusosis may sometimes be present. This is an example of ulnar hemimelia. The frontal radiograph so absent of ulnar peak flexion deformity of the elbow, only three metacapa in the hand. This is an uh, example of the black point brush. So it, the black point brush is normal inside. And morphology, the left radius is all shortened and bold. All alignment identified at the elbow joint with a fraction position of Here, the owner is power absent, the sound index and middle finger narration and normal. The respective three metacapa narration is complete absent of the index and middle finger with their associated metacapa. Pointing are uh, consistent with ulnar hemimelia. Management. The management of such case depends on the age of the patient, variability, and the scope of the handicap. In unilateral case, non surgical intervention like passive stretching exercise. Prothesis, correctives, casting, and splinting are performed to reduce the cosmetic deformity and improve functionality of the limb. Surgery is indicated in bilateral involvement of severe handicap. Surgical management includes that plastic in the cubital portion to decrease the cubital web elbow this articulation and homeroom 
may rotation also to increase range of motion. Thank you.